Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about literal equations, and we're going to solve each equation for the indicated variable. So if I was given this equation, z equals b plus m over a, and we're solving that for a, okay? Well, I'm going to rewrite my equation here, z equals b plus m over a, okay? Well, to go from there, to get a by itself, I'm actually going to multi uh, subtract a b to both sides first. That leaves me with an m over a by itself on the right, and I have z minus b on the left. Now, here's, here's where we can do something, okay? Um, I'm going to multiply both sides by an a, okay? And I know what you're thinking, like, what, what are you doing that for? But make sure when you multiply the left side by an a, we put parentheses, okay? And I'm not going to distribute. What that does is eliminates the a on the right, leaving me with just the m. And I have a times z minus b on the left. Okay? Well, from there, I'm not distributing that a. That would be going backwards. What I'm going to do is actually divide by that whole fraction, z minus b. Why not? I can divide by the whole thing. And what that does, it leaves me with an a by itself, because these cancel. a by itself on the left equals m on the right over z minus b b also on the right, right? m over z minus b, and there we go. We have a by itself, and it's isolated, and it's equal to m over z minus b, and there we go. So let's recap. We're given z equals b plus m over a, and we need to solve that for a. I rewrote my equation, then I subtracted a b to both sides. Then from there, I was left with z minus b equals m over a. I decided to, instead of only focusing on a by itself, sometimes I have to bring it over to the other side, get out of the denominator. So I multiply both sides by a, leaving with a times z minus b on the left equals just m on the right. I did not distribute. Don't distribute that, right? Because that's not going to help break, keep a by itself. That's going to spread a around to different variables. Don't, don't spread the a virus. <laughs> the a virus um, going on there. But then I need to divide by z minus b to both sides to get a by itself, right? So I divided the whole parentheses z minus b to both sides, because there's multiplication really going on here, right? We can do that. And that left us here with a equals m over z minus b, z minus b in the whole denominator, and that was it. We're done. a is isolated, it's by itself. And so my final answer here is a equals m over z minus b.